Hey guys, today we got Bloom Fire released uh, through TND Software. They were a, uh, originally a tape and later a tape and disc based subscription service. Where for on tape for $55 a year and on disc for $70 a year, uh, you got 12 issues of the magazine of the service and each uh, issue was. Uh, Somewhere 8 to 12 programs, somewhere along in that range. Typically one or two games. Uh, I don't know if this game, if this was typical of the quality of games that you got every month, but uh, I have seen more than one game from them that was of this quality. And then, of course, there was Kingpede, a Millipede clone, which was as good as any. Uh, commercially released program that I'd ever seen for the color computer. This game, of course, the obvious comparison that I make to it is uh, Popcorn and, of course, for the Atari 2600, Kaboom. Uh, except, of course, that the balloons are coming up instead of objects falling down and you're shooting them instead of catching them. But it's fairly similar in premise. Uh, there is a certain amount of luck in this game in that uh, the balloons come out somewhat at random and especially as they speed up a little uh, if you're at one side of the screen shooting a balloon and then the balloon comes up on the far side you don't necessarily move across fast enough to catch it. Uh, still it is quite a fun game. Certainly I was, it was a lot happier having popcorn instead of paying for this but you know, if I had uh, bought uh, the TND uh, service and this was just one of the programs that I was getting that month, I would have been uh, quite happy with it. Uh, I am very much enjoying playing it today, and I hope that you enjoy this walkthrough.